Joining me is a special guest right now out of Florida. This is Ronald Cummings, attorney Terry Shoemaker, a very well-respected in that region of the country. Terry, thank you for being with us. Terry, you know, since the first time I met and spoke with Ronald Cummings, I have believed him. It was a gut instinct. No, I never believed he hadn't done drugs. I never believed he had not sold drugs in his past. But his grief over his daughter missing, to me, was genuine. And after trying all those cases for all those years, believe me, I have not hung around with nuns and priests and virgins, all right? So somebody that did drugs, that was not my first time at the rodeo with being with a drug user or seller. Yes. How is he responding to being behind bars, not just because of the drug sales, but because Misty Carlson won't talk about the night Haley went missing? Well, he's, he's very confused right now as to what's going on with Haley's case, you know, because he is behind bars, as you stated. You know, law enforcement isn't keeping him up to date on anything that's going on, and, and he keeps wondering what's going on. Do they have any new leads? Has, has Misty said anything or anybody else? So that's the hardest part from him right now is trying to find out what's going on with his daughter. Well, Terry, my question was more pointed. My question is... I believe a lot of focus came down on your client, Ronald Cummings. Yes, he did the drugs deal, drug deals. I can see that on video. But what they want is the truth about where Haley is. That's what they want. Misty now is telling people, Misty Crosland, that she observed her cousin, who is not a suspect or person of interest, in the home the night the child goes missing. What about that? Well, that's the first I've heard anything about her cousin being in the house that night, the only thing I'd heard previously and the only thing that I believe Ronald's ever heard is that possibly, you know, her brother went over based on some uh, telephone call that supposedly happened when Ronald called the house. So so, that's so you totally had not new. heard this, Terry? No, no, I have not. Okay, let's take a look at the ammunition, just some of it. This is the tip of the iceberg that the state has against Misty Crawlson and Ronald Cummings. There ain't the 25 there. Uh-uh. Yeah. Damn, we got a <laughs> you want, We'll go back if you want. Yeah. You know we ain't do it, man. Because he, he was off and I know I was counting them and I said, dude, that's only 24 right there. Well, it's a so good I thing you look. Yep. Or otherwise you'd only got 24. Mm -hmm. Damn good thing you look. Because he was dropping them. He was so fast. How many does he got left? That was it or what? I don't know. I, I what kind of other stuff? Uh, well, we don't want to with him no more anyway. He uh, don't do good business. That's oh, the end of that. I'll get them She'll, 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 she'll get them. She'll get them, she'll get them for you. Them. I mean, so right now, we, you just got to about them for a minute, but she'll get them. Like I told her earlier, I'll just give you a call when when I'm done out there yeah. and start him at his way and we'll see what's up at that point. Yeah, if I can't, I mean, I don't know if you do Roxy's or whatever, I can get them, but they're f***ing Yeah.